Hello again, this is Oliver and welcome back to yet another video, short video where I explain different analysis techniques for Sudoku. If you like my videos, be sure and give me the thumbs up and you might think of subscribing as well, be greatly appreciated. Now what I have here today is an unusual one. It doesn't come from Duncan's website. This came to me from another person on YouTube. He goes by the I suppose the tag of HLNG and I'm sorry HLNG I don't know what your name is so I'd like to give you um, credit for this it's a type of a chain and it's also a type of a quad now I put a link up here to the actual Sudoku puzzle that I was solving when he came back with this particular solution to it and if we look here at the cells c5 c8 and g5 g8 you know it looks like there we have some sort of an x-wing but it's, it's not actually an x-wing if we look at it as a pairs and uh, an unusual way of looking at it suppose this is off off on off on off on off on therefore if that's on that's off and vice versa if that's on that's off so you could do it looking at pairs and you say those two ones means that we can't have a one here and uh, we can't have a one here now there is another way of looking at it and that is we say we have a quad in these four cells but the four cells are not in a particular house or a row or a column they're in specific two rows and two columns so they form a square so if you have pairs quads that form like this now you can say that for example the ones can't have any other ones there we could do exactly the same with the threes start off here with off on off on off on off on so the threes will either be off or on and that's the way of looking about it is we have four cells and in those four cells we must have one three five or nine and depending on what row or column they're in in this case it's the threes are in this row we can't have any other trees five are in this column we can't have any other fives as in that one the nines are in this row we can't have any other nines but we don't have them and the ones are in this column that's it it's it's a very specific one but i thought it was uh, kind of nice and it gave a very elegant solution to the sudoku a diabolical sudoku from the telegraph that i was trying to uh, start out at the time now uh, as i said it came from a person called hlng and thank you very much for for giving it to me and i'll put a link here to some of my other uh, playlists that you can have a look at either from a beginner's perspective or from an advanced perspective okay so until we meet again slan tamil